Lawrence, we've come to the part of the transmission where I have to talk about DSP. Because to his credit, and credit where it is due, he played pretty well yesterday. And I'm going to talk about that, because we're re-entering a world we've been in before, and we're going to get back to where we were. So can you remember how I mentioned earlier in the playthrough that it was going to be really funny to see him play? Because you can't cheese this game in a lot of ways. Well, I was wrong. Uh, I didn't, never imagined that he would do what he did, but he did, and, you know, God bless him. But he began the game with level 6 armor, and a full armor set that gave him an interesting passive. So for the beginning of the game, stuff that would have killed him in 2 hits was killing him in probably 4 hits, which is kind of ridiculous. So he cheesed the entire start of the game due to the fact that he had ridiculous armor. But that's not a problem, that's fine. He started using a spear, which is really, really clever, even though I wish he didn't, because it's easy mode, because spears are really, really strong, and you're never in danger when you're using them if you use them correctly, but he did. But he then went on to the Hino Enma level, and he fought Hino really intelligently. He was being spacious, he was dodging, he was, he was being smart, he was being patient, he wasn't getting greedy, and he played really, really well. So uh, I'm happy to say that he did a good job. I'm glad, you know. I don't take pleasure in in shitting on people for the sake of shitting on people. It's always got a point behind it in my brain. So it was nice to see him him play the game and try and learn it. So I'm hoping for better, better things. Because it was good to see he's Kai pulsing. He's doing uh, the kick moves as well. Oh, it resets it, does it? Damn. I used all my bullets shooting this shit the first time. So I'm, I'm going to ignore these areas then, I'm just going to skip them. If you even... Oh, that's the uh, Corridor of Doom, isn't it? Dude just chucks a fucking stone at me. You know what this is a good idea to do? Test the salt. Interesting, it's close range. <laughs> that did not have the range I thought it would have. Let's put something stupid on. See what it does. Toss it to the ground and wait to Kodama will soon appear. What? Hmm. Yeah, look at that. I've got three full heals there. That's ninjutsu. There, toss this. What is that one? Um. There you go. Let's do that little geezer. Damn. Was there something explosive there? That was crazy. So Neo has got a lot of interesting stuff in this game. You've just got to mess with it. I, I can't, I'm, I'm bad though because I feel like I need to save that for something really important. But I liked it. It looked cool. Let's put something else on. A moment talisman. Mm. Ooh, bombs. I should use some bombs. I ain't used many bombs. Bombs could be useful. There's a ladder. I did not mean to do that. That's full fledged poison, right? Yeah. I don't really like how how you can hit stuff. That's the type of shit they shouldn't have inherited. They've taken a lot of bad things from Souls games that I don't think anybody likes. I get why they've done it though, because, you know, why not, I guess. Fuck the player, it's the easiest way to, to make games. Arbitrarily fuck the player. So somebody, oh he's throwing a stone. Oh no, he's throwing a bomb, oh we could have bomb wars. Yeah, eat my dick, bomb war. Bomb war, I win. Bitch. That's why you don't play bomb wars. 
They're very dangerous. Right. Is this the... Yeah, I know this room. I think. How many arrows have I got? Uh, not enough. <laughs> have I got any gun? I've got one gun. Great English, I know. You'll have to bear with me. Let's set this off. I know where to run to the next shrine, because I remember this area. I think it was... over here. I could be wrong, though. Maybe I don't know this area. I thought I did. Yeah, it's come to my attention that perhaps... I think they're explosive, those circle things. kind of what I'm getting from this. It would make sense, right? Well, the poison's coming back. So is this the beginning? I can't tell. Is this where we start, guys? Yeah, this is where we started. Okay. I need to, uh... Not do that, then. I need to find the right way to to go forward. Because <laughs> if you remember, I thought I was at the beginning before, and I wasn't. Let's just fuck this analog a little bit, if I can. It's ironic, right? I've had a PlayStation 3 probably 10 years or some shit longer than I've had a PS4 and the sticks on that controller work perfectly fine and they've had five times the use that this one's had yet yeah, this is the one that's all fucked up and stupid I find that not awkward did he reset? interesting I guess he must have done there you go friend Breaking the law. Can you hear anybody following me? <laughs> yeah, this, this is more like it. Right. I kind of know where I am. Hi. About to get an axe in my brain. Yeah, very scary. Yeah, it's down here, right? Do I need a key for this? I need a key for it. Oh my god, I wish he did save the fucking state. Hi. I don't remember where I got the key. set something off with fire. I suppose if maybe I can toss a bomb like Dark Souls style. I just press the Dark Souls button for bomb, but that's not what the button is in this game. Yeah, I think that, that's uh, an accelerant of explosives. I think that's what that is. Is this the key? That is the key. Nice. So I've just kind of skipped a lot to get back to this which is going to then lead to the shrine which is really good and now we're completely back to where we were and it took what like nine minutes which is not a speed run but it's better than it, it could have been and then this next room is really difficult if you remember because it's got that wheelie dude that's a bitch and he starts at the same point every time he starts there And I missed his ass because I'm bad. Fire breath. Yeah, it does the same thing every time. And of course, I'm hitting the wall. So why would I not? Ow. Have they buffed these guys? They were not that strong when you fought them in the beta. And 
if you remember, this guy uh, is on the end of a, a falling platform. We've got the ventilator there, doing ventilating things. We've got this dude. And his armor, which can't be broken because this game is retarded. I don't know, I get the feeling like they should have a system where if you attack armoured attacks in, a, in the right stance, you crush them. That seems like that would be just common sense to a designer, but I guess not. Maybe that system does exist, I hope it does, because it fucking should. Well, that's unfortunate, I couldn't change quick enough. If that'd be death if I dropped on him from here. I should really go this way. See what's over here. Monsters. Always monsters. There he goes, Boomer turning. My most powerful attack misses. Because of spacing errors? Always fun. Kyaku Dama. Is there more poison? Yeah, do you see what I mean though? It looks. I broke it by moving through it. Oh, maybe not. It's hard to manually aim in this game. Yeah, that definitely looks. Can I get rid of that, dude? Yeah, I can. Then I can do this right. Interesting, why'd you get all your shit back? So, we're being... Viciously poisoned. I didn't think the poison was all that in interesting in this game, but it seems to be a little stronger than I gave it a respect for being. So, shame on me, I guess. Did it just push me into a boss fight? I think it did. And I don't have any healing items that I'm willing to spare with. And it's a crazy human centipede thing. running is gonna fuck me here. Well, that was very kind of the game. If this was Ninja Gaiden, that would have probably done a lot of damage to me. Just because Ninja Gaiden... Okay. I thought I was safe up there. <laughs> I was not. The Great Centipede, eh? comes. 
It's interesting that you can get up there. I didn't expect that. So how the fuck do I fight this? Whoa. This movement is awkward. That is pretty good pathfinding. I'll give him that much. Can I hit his tail? Oh, he's poisoning me. I'm done. So there's a phase where he fires and you have to excavate it or get rid of it. Ventilate it, whatever word you would use. Question is, how the hell do I get back to that quickly? Oh, I should have opened that door, shouldn't I? I don't like that wheel enemy. I think it was perfectly fine in the beta, but I feel like they've ruined it for the main game. Because it moves too fast, I think. Is that all this is? Yeah, that's all this is. I can't use it because I'm on the, on the thing. <laughs> Some things they haven't inherited then from the Souls games, like knowledgeable stuff. Is this guy going to do it again? So this must be the shortcut. Right. Dude, fuck you with that bullshit! Oh my god, look at that trash, dude. I hate that. That is everything wrong with the stamina system there. Remember how I was telling you that you could run to a fucking item, pick it up, and during the animation you had no stamina and the dude popped up and hit you? That's what that is. Bullshit. By any other word. Garbage. Fluent fucking low tier garbage. Fucking awkward enough. My dude stutter stepping like a twat. But no, we've got a fucking. Stamina crush you at the door with a stupid yokai. Because why the fuck would it not do that, right? Don't take your timer, old dickhead. It's not important. Is it coming here? The balls. Well, there's a shortcut anyway. Yeah, I feel like those wheelie guys should not be heavy heavy hitters at all when it comes to HP. They should be weak, but they should be incredibly mobile. But instead, they, they take a million fucking hits for some gay reason. I blame motorcyclists. Interesting, it didn't trip that before, if you remember. What if I can shoot bombs at this dude? Anyway. Let's do it, shall we? That's the thing that poisons everything. You think there's a trick to hurting this dude? Because I'm not used to such a big enemy without a, a direct way of damaging it. He's on fire for half a second. I wish my bow and my gun were, were all fully cunned. 
don't know what word I tried to say then, I just gave up on it. It was fun. Shit. Ah! You're gonna hurt! Oh, he can just fall. That's legit. I don't have any range left anyway. <laughs> I'm dead. I don't get this at all. This dude moves a little bit too Ninja Gaiden 2 here for me. It's a little too perfect in its movement, a little too bullshitty. Oh wow, thank you. Oh, I was alive! Interesting. It's just really confusing, like... I don't know how to... I should try smacking it, but... It's a moving hurt box. Stuff like that usually ends badly. Are they gonna follow? I hope they don't follow. Right, so the bomb doesn't do much. I wonder if I can use my little buddy to help. I used that. That thing was ridiculously powerful. Hmm. What about element it's weak to? I don't really understand the elements at the moment. I'm gonna pop these things on. Send that little fella out, he can do the work for me. It wouldn't do it. That's what cool. I just fucking hit you, dude! I can, but it's, uh, it's bad. I, I just, I don't get it. Like, I don't understand how to fight this thing at all. <laughs> It's one of those kind of, it's going against everything I know about the game encounters. Thanks. Hmm. Staying on the ground though doesn't seem good, because the poison is, is bad. Like, it seems like I got poison out of him just for hitting him. Get him, dude. Oh, don't get him. Wow, I'm so use such a useful tool in my answer. Oh, it's paralyzing. And then poison. And then no hitbox on its on its taily thing. Lock-on is really hurting me here. <laughs> I don't get it. <laughs> this is really weird. There must be a way to stun it. Like some method of knocking it over and letting me hit it without it chasing me down and hitting me. I can't imagine they would design a boss where I can't hurt it without it hurting me because that just sounds the antithesis of this. But if anything, this is very Ninja Gaiden-y. Because Ninja Gaiden is a kind of game where they don't give a shit, they just throw everything at you. But, we'll see. That could be interesting. Like, I don't understand where the windows of attack are and the safety and things.
So I'm not going to lock on either, as, as foolish as that may prove to be. So I'm going to try and get him to to chase me around here, and then I want to do this. I don't know what happened. Something happened. I'm falling though and I'm poisoned. It's like they're all separate entities, aren't they? They're not it's not like one thing, it's it's a parasite of hive mind kind of thing. And they all fucked off down there, wherever that leads to. Uh, I need an amulet against poison. That would be really, really good right now. Still not seeing how you can do this without getting hurt, though. I was hoping he wouldn't move on his own body, and he totally did. Are you see? What the fuck? Tell you what I can do that I do know will work. I think, anyway. Can you, can you hit him, dude? You fucking idiot! No. Maybe you can block that first hit. Maybe that's an idea. Oh, you can! Okay. And then that happened. Which is... And then that happened. <laughs> Did he plunge attack me? Dude. This is... This feels really messy in like a goofy way. <laughs> All the bosses so far have been spot on. This one seems kind of shitty. <laughs> Messy as fuck, I love it. It's exactly what I want from this game. Messy fights. Hmm. So, get him to trip the block and then get behind him. Hit the face, right? Get super poisoned. Because he it's like he passively releases poison when you hit him. Which is exactly what we wanted, right? It's the one thing that we wanted to happen. I want to fight him on the floor because I don't want him knocking me off again. Oh, look, he's, it's the shit rock. He dropped shit rocks. It makes so much sense. Where is he? He's there. So, I'm going to block the first hit like a bitch. Then I'm going to scrub it out at the back of him. Oh, no, I'm not because he... He has a different hit. And I can't move. Probably back to the poison again. Did he push me in the hole? Oh, did you see that? My stamina is not faring very well. Never even thought. And he's off. 
again. He's gonna come out one of the holes. There he comes. And he does the big one. Oh, that's a paralyzing one. And then he comes back at you again. There's the paralyzing one again. Is it better to hit the face or to kill the body? Oh my god! I just nearly got fucked. Currently in the process of getting the fucked. That's the fucked. Get it? Because I'm an expert linguist. It's making more sense now, at least. I'm just losing stamina a lot. Because I'm not fluxing and Kai pulsing and doing all the other sexy things. Boom. It's the poison. And it poisoned me. And I pressed circle then to, to dodge. That's not how you dodge, guys. I'm out of healing items too, so I'm, I'm a goner pretty much, but I was closer at least. Let's check my uh, talismans, see if I've got anything for both paralysis and for poison, and maybe we'll, we'll work towards being better at this boss. Because this boss is kicking my shit in. Let's have a look. So that's plus two against paralysis, but I don't know if that's good enough. Seven point two percent against poison. Here we go. Plus seventeen versus poison. Is that good though? I don't know if that's good. We got a paralysis one. There you go. It's about as good as it's getting. Let's think about this. Hmm. I mean, I should probably put antidotes on, right? Because I keep using the fuckers. That seems like probably a good idea. These white gloves are not doing much for me, it must be said. <laughs> but they're incredibly light. So it'll help me get stamina back quickly. Quickly, like that. That's language. So, hmm. Let's do this. I did Kai pulls it. Oh, they also dropped the energy too. I didn't realize. I'm never gonna get my stamina back, dude. Not in this shit. Ah. So when you kill them, they, they drop pools of yokai. Which is kind of a nuisance. Please don't poison me, please don't poison me, please I right, poison me. <laughs> I think the plunge attack was doing anything good. Can't even tell. Okay, said I've already a prick. Did I try to see what that did, that item? I don't know if I did. It still 
fucking hit me. You got scrub. I don't like how it can just move through its own body. That's really fucking stupid. It's an antidote, isn't it? Yeah, no. It's kind of waste of that, but what can you do? Oops, you can do that. And waste another one. It actually got rid of it, which is nice. That was great. Yeah, I don't like this fight at all. It's really annoying me. Climb the ladder, please. Or oh, don't. Just end this place, that'd be wonderful. Apparently not. For some reason he's running away. Kudos to that though, right? That move does a lot of damage. Why that? Uh, this might be a better place to fight him up here. Get him into this little crazy loop thing. Ow. That still hit me, did you see that? I did a dodge, and it still, like, wiped the side of me. So I feel like that was something. It is well known that the yokai lash out stronger the fiend grows, but I've never seen anything like this. So let's let's recap. Being down there sucks because the poison is too temperamental. Being up here seems kind of great. That was a really really interesting way of doing it. You block the first hit. After that, he either does the paralysis thing, he does the poison thing, or he does the belly flop. All of them can be blocked. All of them can be dodged. And if you manipulate the controls correctly. Uh, you can hit his body in between and then just go back to the beginning, block the first hit, wait for whatever he does next, hit, 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 stamina back, block the first hit. That's probably a really, 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 really simple boss, but he was kicking my ass for whatever reason. And I used all my healing items. And there's, there's items down there, and I want to get them. But there's also poison, so I need to get rid but it was something. It just... I don't know. I have difficulty with certain concepts in games and that was definitely one of them. Just the idea that him moving is constantly a damage. So you have to do something about him moving, but he's always trying to move. Uh, I couldn't get my head around it. Anti-paralytic needle. 
Who needs paralysis when your controller barely works? <laughs> but it began really crazy, really sloppy, really messy, and, and I kind of get it a little bit more now, so I see the potential in that fight. I did not see the potential to begin with. There you go.